1989, I was asked by the French government to put on a show that would celebrate the bicentennial anniversary of its revolution. Not an easy assignment if you consider that President Mitterrand didn't want any kind of nostalgic evocation. So, instead of celebrating the revolution per se, we focused on one of the great principles it stood for, the rights of man which to me at least felt much more comfortable. And to perform the Marseillaise, France's national anthem, we simply asked the best singer in the whole world, Jessie Norman, if she'd sing. <laughs> a court of ballet of Senegalese tribal dancers performed their version of Swan Lake. To light up the whole Champs-Élysées could have been a little too elaborate, so it seemed to me like a much better idea to equip each musician with his own battery-operated self-lighting system. Everybody knows it always rains in England, so we asked the British to perform under artificial rain. Same thing for the East Indians of London. Snow in Russia is as stereotypical as rain in England. This is why there was no reason we shouldn't ask the Russians to perform this time under artificial snow. King of soul music, James Brown. He was kind of busy at the time. It would have been great to have him perform that night, but uh, we had no choice. So we had to settle for the greatest marching band of all times, who played all of his hits. Oh! 